celebs including Ava DuVernay, Patti Lapone, react to Halloween Kyle Rittenhouse verdict. Twitter was swift to react following the across-the-board acquittal of Kyle Rittenhouse, who last summer shot and killed two men and wounded another when he crossed state lines with a gun during protests against police violence. After more than three days of deliberation, the nearly all-white jury acquitted Rittenhouse, now 18, on Friday in the shooting deaths of Joseph Rosenbaum, 36, and Anthony Huber, 26. Rittenhouse was also acquitted in the shooting of Gage Grossgrutz, 27, who survived. Lawyers for the teen, who drove from Antioch, Illinois to Kenosha, Wisconsin that night, said he was acting in self-defense when he shot at the trio, something many people, from all walks of life, have had trouble believing. Oscar-nominated director Ava DuVernay was among the celebrities to voice her disgust at the verdict. John Huber and Karen Bloom, parents of murderer hashtag Kyle Rittenhouse victim Anthony Huber. The verdict sends the unacceptable message that armed civilians can show up in any town, incite violence, and then use the danger they have created to justify shooting people in the street, she tweeted. Rachel Zegler, who stars as Maria in the upcoming West Side Story adaptation, wrote the acquittal for such heinous heinous crimes is the epitome of white privilege and exactly what is wrong with this godforsaken country. Referring to the overabundance of people of color who have received serious convictions for drug-related non-violent offenses, actor Michael Ian Black tweeted. In fairness, Kyle Rittenhouse only killed two people. It's not like he was smoking weed. The verdict has shown that it remains legal to murder while white, tweeted Phineas. Patti Lapone said that the acquittal gives them permission to kill and she has now lost the definition of right and wrong. Reminding people to spare a thought for the families of the victims, MSNBC correspondent Joy Reid tweeted that, there is nothing here but tragedy, and these families are in pain. Though not surprising to Roxanne Gay, the author tweeted that the verdict was hollowing. I knew Rittenhouse would be acquitted but it is getting to witness the inevitable, to know there will be no consequences for the judge, and to know Rittenhouse and others like him will be more emboldened to be openly white supremacist vigilantes.